Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Paint Spatter up on YouTube. i um, here today just to show you a quick and easy way to unlock your iPhone 3G um, and put it on T-Mobile. Um, I've been searching through YouTube for several days now uh, to try to find a whole bunch of, I guess, different videos to help me unlock this phone and jailbreak it. So I finally got it done, um, and I hope you like it and enjoy uh, start off here. I downloaded Red Snow um, point nine or nine point six B five. Um, that's the newest version to allow um, for your iPad um, to change the carrier for it. Basically, once you get that um, downloaded, and I, I'll have all the links in the description for you to go get all the all of this stuff. You want to run it as an administrator. Uh, that helps for errors. And make sure that you keep uh, your Red Snow and your iPhone uh, firmware on the desktop so that way Red Snow or anything doesn't crash. See, IPSW successfully identified. Now with this new Red Snow, basically what you're here to look for is um, once it pops up, right here where it says install iPad broadband or baseband you want to check that and just click yes and then you'll click next while you have your phone hooked up to your computer and then it'll cycle through your jailbreak and um, send you through DFU mode <clears throat> now once your phone is actually jailbroken um, you'll be able to get into Cydia and as you can see here this is jailbroken and it has a Ed Hardy theme just running Cydia now <clears throat> with this jailbreak um, to unlock the phone for T-Mobile um, I'm running a 4.2.1 firmware I think that's the newest version of the iPhone firmware um, and it seems to be doing okay um, but basically once you get into Cydia you want to go to search and you can uh, search SB as um, SB is in Sam Bravo settings And then there it is right there. You just click that. Click install. And then it'll download to your phone. And then basically from there what you want to do is the phone will reboot. So once you go through all of that and reboot it, don't forget this is a tethered jailbreak. So you'll definitely have to hook your phone back up to your computer hook it up to red snow and then once you get into red snow there's a little box that says just boot tethered now and I'll show that to you always run as administrator browse for your firmware you gotta do this every time um, to reboot your phone so if your phone dies or you turn it off or something like that um, definitely make sure that you are by a computer so that way you can restart it just a couple seconds here all right see down here at the bottom it says just boot tethered right now that's what you'll click everything else will become unchecked you go to next follow through and it will <clears throat> go ahead and restart your phone. Now, I think Cydia is good. Yeah. So you downloaded SBS settings, and you'll need to download Ultra Snow. See, there it is. I've already installed it. 
<clears throat> and this is what you need to unlock the phone for T-Mobile. Now, whenever I was messing around with it and trying to get it unlocked, um, I downloaded Ultra Snow first, and up here in the top left corner where it says T-Mobile, um, it was saying searching, and it wouldn't work. <clears throat> So I had to restore the whole phone and jailbreak it again. So what I recommend is definitely going into Cydia, downloading SB settings, and then downloading Ultra Snow. And that'll save you like so much time. Then you can see here, um, by doing the jailbreak uh, with the Red Snow 9.6 B5, um, this will allow you to have a carrier option and you want to keep it to automatic and it'll pull up a list of carriers typically AT&T and T-Mobile um, and I'll go into general for you and you can see it says T-Mobile 4.2.1 and then this is what's important um, your modem firmware is 6.15.00 um, you definitely need to make sure that you have that or something of the sort so that way you can you don't have any issues unlocking the phone um, so go into network and you're gonna have to set the phone up for a T-Mobile um, and for T-Mobile you want to turn off 3G and then turn data roaming on once you got that just go into cellular data and then here at APN you want to type in epc.tmobile.com and I'll have all this in the description for you under MMS you want to go to the APN um, and it says W A is in Apple P is in Paul dot voicestream dot com and then scroll down to MMSC and you want to type in two point or two one six point one five five point one seven four point eight four forward slash serve let's forward slash m m s that's Mary Mary Sam and then you scroll down to the MMS proxy and you want to type in two one six point one five five point one six five point five zero colon eight zero eight zero and for those of you that don't know what a colon is it's the two dots right on top of each other and then once you got all of that set up and put in there just go back to here and you want to restart the phone remember to plug your phone back in and run it through red snow so that way um, it's it starts back up in a jailbroken mode um, put your sim card in while it's shut off and then turn it off, go into settings, and then go into carrier, and then make sure automatic is clicked, and then T-Mobile should pop right up in the top left corner. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you have any questions, message me. Please rate and comment and subscribe. Thank you.